What we have here is a Samsung Galaxy Tab 4, a Lava USB host mode, uh, we call it a simul charge adapter, and a digital SLR. And what I'd like to show you is how to use the tablet in close connection to the digital SLR. There are lots of apps for doing that and I'll show you one called DSLR Dashboard. What you do is you plug your USB cable into your camera and plug your USB cable into the simul charge adapter and then plug the simul charge adapter into the tablet. When you do that the tablet will detect the connector and when you turn on the camera the tablet will offer you applications that are matched to the camera. I pick DSLR dashboard and at this point I have a whole set of controls that will let me choose my uh, compression settings for camera, my image file sizes, my ISO setting, my white balance, and and on it goes. Uh, metering, focus uh, metering, and so on. Full camera control through the tablet. In addition, uh, you can use the tablet as a live view interface and like so here's my hand and you also have a number of things that are not native to the camera itself time-lapse capability and uh, extensive bracketing and focus stacking and interval shooting capabilities. Some of these capabilities require the tablet to be on for an extended period of time if you wanted to do a long time lapse for example. And here's where the simul charge adapter actually offers advantages beyond being a, an OTG interface because it has a power connector on the side. And with that you can take your tablet's power and power adapter, plug it in, and now you'll see that the tablet actually is charging while in host mode. The simul charge USB is the only uh, the only device that will do this. So now, when you go back into DSLR dashboard and choose, for example, a time lapse photography session, your tablet can stay on for as long as you need, which extends the capabilities of your digital SLR quite extensively. So that's it. That's the Lava Simul Charge Host and Charge Adapter.